Delirium is an independent predictor of increased mortality at six months and longer length of stay in ventilated intensive care patients. The confusion assessment method for the ICU, CAM ICU, and the Intensive Care Delirium Screening Checklist ICE, are the most valid and reliable delirium monitoring tools in adult ICU patients. Three subtypes of delirium have been characterized, hyperactive, hypoactive and mixed. Treatment of delirium includes pharmacological and non-pharmacological measures. For the management of hyperactive or mixed delirium, haloperidol is the treatment of choice, however, it carries a risk of Q. T prolongation and should not be used if the Q. TC is prolonged, more than 450 millisecond. Benzodiazepines should be used to manage specific delirium syndromes such as alcohol withdrawal and otherwise avoided as they can contribute to the delirium. Midazolam or propofol could be used as rescue therapy for rapid tranquilization if other therapy is failing and the patient poses a danger to themselves or attending staff, but should otherwise be avoided. There is increasing evidence that atypical antipsychotics, such as quetiapine, may reduce the duration of delirium in adult ICU patients, but there are no parenteral formulations. In mechanically ventilated adult ICU patients at risk of developing delirium, dexmedetomidine infusions administered for sedation may be associated with a lower prevalence of delirium compared with benzodiazepine infusions.